Hello again, SC2 Junkies, and today I'm going to bring you the second game of Cheese vs. Eek. And as you can see here, Eek did pick Blistering Sand, so you can see Cheese is already nervous with his good cluck. Have fun. Uh, obviously, nothing too amazing happening here in the early game. Both players just getting up their economy. Mm, these cute little SCVs are mining some minerals. Uh, we are having a nine overlord come out from Mr. Eek as this big bug slugs his way over the map and attempts to find himself some Terrans. We are having a ten depot go down rather than the early racks like last game. Um, so she's just uh, preferring not to go overlord hunting on this map. I'm kind of confused on why as it is a smaller map. Um, he is going to go for a fast refinery though, so maybe we'll see some reapers. Um, not 100% sure on the Terran built for reapers to be honest, I'm a Zerg player myself. So, I'm kind of curious, as you can see this SCV is dancing over here, doing a little disco, and he's going to go ahead and start building now. Playtime's over, time to work. This drone is going to mosey his way on in, he missed the dance party, but now he is just going to start giving the SCV a high five. And uh, SCV doesn't like it, he's going to start drilling them. Pretty mean right there. But, you know, I guess people can't have fun all the time. SCV's mad, he had to work rather than dance. And uh, now this SCV's running for his life. His drone's pissed off, started spitting some acid. No more high fives for him. Now he's being chased across the map, he does get away though. Looks like he's fired, left the job. As this drone looks to get some more SCVs, he's just very irate attack and shit. As you can see here we do have a fast expansion before any type of pull here so this Terran player is going to have to put on some early pressure or expand himself in order to counter this. He does go a rather late um, orbital command here and as you can see Cheese is well aware that this expansion went down right here and as we do have this pull finally coming up around 16 so he went a 14 hatch 16 pull here and uh, we do have two drones um, maybe they're just going to chill in this area. Maybe uh, stop any bunkers coming out. No, actually they're just going to get some minerals and head back up. Uh, this overlord is just scoping shit out. Uh, factories coming down along with the reactor. We're going to have some early Hellions once again. Uh, Mule is down. Terran's favorite unit. Guy that mines minerals faster than anything in the world. If only he could be on gas too. Uh, these drones are actually still left on this expo, but they are going to be able to return to this uh, hatchery that just completed. We do have a gas out. Uh, no speedlings are incoming as uh, the drones just started getting gas. The queen is going to be rallied over to this expansion, it looks like, and after he spews on the initial thing, we are having two Hellions come out now for Cheese, and Cheese is going to put down a supply depot by this back door because no one likes to take it from behind. It's very painful, and yeah, it wouldn't be very nice. Uh, this overload's being sneaky. Hopefully we don't see any more Nidus's from uh, Eek here. Uh, Cheese did not like those last game, uh, even though he did end up pulling it out in the end. Uh, we are having a spine crawler come up a tad bit late. He's not going to get up in time. And these uh, Hellions are going to be able to march in. As you can see, this queen is positioning right here, but he didn't position on the ramp, which is going to be a bit painful. And these Hellions are going to squeeze by... Uh, that fat queen, and actually he ends up microing this queen off the creep, and it's going to take time to get back on. And we're going to have 4th of July early here, and these drones are just going to get nice and toasty. Uh, zerglings are coming out, but, oh, some brilliant micro coming in from Cheese. <laughs> we have a Hellion with 2 HP, and now uh, both uh, Hellions are very, very low, as two more Hellions do come in to back them up. So we are having just a ridiculous barbecue go on in this Zerg base. Uh, and we are having the Hellions split up now as the Queen does f f chase down the two red ones. But now these two other Hellions are able to roast some more drones. And we're just having a ridiculous amount of drones go down. This main expansion is pretty much droneless. It has three drones on minerals from almost being saturated. And actually we might end up getting losing all these drones here on this main. Uh, one Hellion does finally get caught up in between the Queen and the Zerglings. And we do have one Hellion just kind of running around um, looks like he's gonna try to micro it back in the base I guess assuming that there will be a spine crawler w awaiting him at the bottom 
he, there is not though and it looks like um, we do have a command center up over here <laughs> just this Helen is going bazonkers with seven kills now I wonder if he's gonna be able to make it out of there alive it's just hero Helen over here in the base uh, looks like cheese is slipping up on his macro a bit just from all this ridiculous micro he is performing with this one Hellion right now. As you can see, he's going to try to peek in a few more hits right here. He does back up. We do have two more Hellions at the um, front door waiting to get some more action going. And it looks like this Hellion is just going to chill back here. Uh, he doesn't get this last drone for his efforts. He's finished this off with seven kills. And you can see we do have two Hellions in the back of the base now with one kill. Um, the other Hellion died without getting any kills for himself. Um, this creep tumor is passed up by this Hellion. A bit unfortunate. But what are you going to do? We do have uh, two Hellions attacking this spine crawler, and they are not going to be happy because they're not heroes like their friend. So, after some crazy hero Hellions, some not so hero Hellions, we do have some crazy economical damage done to the Zerg player. Um, uh, that I Essentially, that fast expansion completely did not pay off for Eek at all. He was just pressured so hard and just got the crap beat out of him. This overlord is scouting now. That cheese does have his expo up and running. And there is now being a bunker put down by the expansion. We are having some massive mech play. Once again coming from cheese. Uh, I mean you don't fix what isn't broke, right? You don't yeah. I guess that's the right saying. Um I guess Eek's having a creep tumor party over here. One isn't enough. You know, two is always better. Um, some hydrogen is kind of like, I guess, chasing down Hellions at their lightning fast speed. Turtle versus the hare going on, you know, fun action. And we do just have three little Zerglins just beating away at some rocks here. More and more creep tumors can never have enough, especially when they're right next to each other. Lots of Hellions. Should probably repair them. Hurt Hellions will never kill.